sitting by a small pond in the woods. I've been here since just before sunrise and I'm waiting to see if I can video some beavers. I know there are beavers in this pond because I've seen them here before in the last few years. It's very nice just to sit in the quiet, listen to the bird song and hear the wind, even if we don't see anything. It's a, a pleasure to sit here for a few hours before breakfast. to see the black grouse. Um, really unusual to see it sort of perched openly like that. Um, usually it's just a clatter of wings and the shape of it disappearing off into the woods as you disturb it. So absolutely awesome to uh, get to watch it for a few minutes like that. Really made my morning. sat for a little while longer but uh, the beavers didn't come out so now I'm heading back to get some breakfast and some coffee. I'll probably try to go to another location where I know there is a very active beaver lodge and I'll pick the video up from there. sitting out quietly by a lake where there's another very active beaver lodge. I know this one's active because I saw beavers here only this summer and it's all built up with lots of extra mud and sticks on top of it for the winter. I've been sitting here since, since dawn but I haven't seen any beavers and I was here yesterday in the rain watching and I didn't see them then either. The difficulty with watching them in the morning is that the nights are so long that they have plenty of time to do whatever it is they want to do and you don't see them. Evening tends to be a better time to watch beavers, in my experience at least. Anyway, it's been very, very nice sitting here, um, just quietly in the woods, by the water, listening to the wind in the trees and watching the sunrise and listening to the birds. I've heard a black woodpecker and a raven and quite a few different smaller birds as well. I'm probably just going to give up on the beavers for this trip and I'll tag on right at the end a short clip of uh, a beaver from here from uh, this summer. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to go back to the car and collect a, a hare that I found killed on the road and I'm going to put it in the woods and I'm going to put my wildlife camera on it and that's going to be sitting for two weeks and we shall see what comes to feed on it. If I record anything interesting, I'll make a separate video about that and that will probably be sometime in sort of mid to late November. Anyway, hopefully you've enjoyed uh, this footage from the forests of Finland. 
So uh, thank you very much for watching and goodbye.